Rose is dumb, and today we added to another video. Today we added to shame while white people like country music. Now, listen, if you haven't seen my other video, the Special Olympics, I suggest you go check that out. Like, I promise you, I never laughed so much. I don't know the last time I laughed so hard during a, a comedy, like a stand up. I don't know the last time I laughed. Bro, Kevin Hart, you gotta come better, bro. This special that you finna drop, Kevin Hart, it, bro, it better be good, because the last ones, they been. Like, you, you're losing us. You're losing us. But, man, my white people love country music. I'm telling you, like, I like country music. I like country music, even though nine times out of ten, it's just them drunk, talking about an ex-girlfriend, how they got cheated on. But it hit. It hit every single time. But let's go ahead and get into this video. If you do, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know down below what I should write to, what I should react to next. Don't forget to follow by Instagram at tv.dub. And let's get into this. I know. I just moved to New York this year. And, uh, yeah, it's all right. New York's all right. It's nice. I, I like it more than I thought I would, but uh, from Florida, I just, bro, just found I out I was fat. I hate people moved out here from New York. Just th I'm 31. I just this year found out that I was a fat guy. I'm from a white trash enough town that this was killing it. <laughs> people back home see me, they're like, what's your fucking secret? I'm like, oh, but just hanging out, man. <laughs> That's crazy. Hang out. <laughs> And then, I don't know, I moved, uh, I moved to Philly first. I lived in Philly for like two oh years. Oh my. Yeah, gay birds. And then, uh. Bro, if you ever want to get, oh my god, no, people from Philly, even the girls, oh my god, from New York and Philly, bro. You want to get choked on? You want somebody to hurt your feelings? Uh, but it was funny because I moved like from a white trash town to Philly, like right during the presidential election. Hmm. <laughs> you pussies. Uh, no, but it was funny because like that was a big jump. I went from like an all white trash town to then to the city where now all my new friends were like real woke, and that was like because if like if this was my hometown, someone could just walk in here in full camouflage and sit down, and you'd be like, "That's a fucking good outfit." <laughs> hey, you trying to get pussy here, right there? Come on, man. <laughs> has to be the most country bro what walk in with a camouflage suit and that's you dressing up bro who you trying to get with bro that's crazy like, that's a fucking good outfit that's dude, crazy you trying to get pussy in here tonight dude come on man you going full camo at Clusterfest alright like everybody I grew up with listens to country music and I don't but I get it like I understand why white people like it you know like you can relate to it yeah you can understand all the lyrics. Yeah. You don't need to Google what a nene is. <laughs> not, I don't know if you know this. Every country song is just about exactly what a white guy is doing at that moment. Facts. It's like, I turn the radio up. It's like, yeah, fuck yeah. That's facts. That's good. That's music. That's what I like. That's facts. It hit, though. You get it. You can relate to it. I ride around. I listen to rap. That's all I listen to. I can't relate to one fucking song. <laughs> I just ride around by myself, bob my head, just like, I beat the pussy up. Like, oh. <laughs> and just like, I beat the pussy up. It's like, oh. <laughs> I, I, like, I don't know if I beat it up. Like, I'm like, I'll shadow box the pussy. I've never... I ain't never knocked it out. Everyone's knocking out pussy. He's, I've never oh, knocked I'm it out. Not, I'm more like Floyd Mayweather with the pussy. Very technical. <laughs> very defensive. <laughs> That's all I listen to. I just ride around and listen to people brag about how good they are at sex. I don't That's think I've ever made a girl make a sound with my dick. <laughs> Except like when I lay no. on them at first and they're like oh. <laughs> <laughs> bro, this is my new favorite like, This is my new favorite comedian bro This is my new favorite bro What the f Bro this is not something you're supposed to tell the world bro Oh my goodness This is something you're supposed to tell your friends <laughs> Close friends, maybe a close relative, bro. You're so nasty, bro. You're, bro, what? This is how comedy is supposed to be, bro. You should be able to talk about anything, bro. This, bro, nah, he's crazy. The stories I got, I'm taking them to the grave. <laughs> Except, like, when I lay on them at first and they're like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> 
That's it, just, oh, Jesus, mister. <laughs> First, and they're like, oh. <laughs> That's it, just, oh, Jesus, mister. Hey, hey, bro. Oh, my goodness. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. All right, I don't know what that's like. like I don't know what that's like, but you have had a big. Okay. You have had a big girl. Lay on you, and then she asks you if she's heavy. <laughs> and in your head, you want to say yeah, but you say no. Your leg asleep, your arm asleep. Like this whole, your whole left side of your body is gone because she's laying on it, bro. I'm telling, bro. Love big girls, though, but bro. Oh my goodness, I don't know why this just make me think of this one girl. Oh, let me stop talking. Yeah. Good. <laughs> That's where I'm from. <laughs> and then I moved to the city. And here, let me lose you again real quick. Uh, it was right during the presidential election. And uh, it was funny because all my friends went from like white trash to like I said, woke. And they were all like, they're all like, did you guys all vote Democrat? Did anybody here vote? No, they don't vote. Uh... Do you guys, do you guys remember how like confident you guys were? I gotta go to one of his things. Going into that last one? Oh, you remember that? A little borderline arrogant going into that. All right. Don't let it cost you again. Facts. No, I relax. Relax. I did not vote for him. I did. I did. Yeah, fuck yeah. I did. <laughs> no, I, act I actually did not vote for him, which that was tough. Look at me. His whole campaign was at me. I'm lying. I was I watching TV. He was like, are you a fucking fat idiot? I was like, yeah, dude. <laughs> yeah, what are we doing? What the fuck are we doing, dude? We're building walls? Hell yeah. <laughs> Stupid. I took skull Stupid. out of my mouth to come up here. <laughs> and I didn't vote for Donald Trump. <laughs> Makes me like the Nelson Mandela of central Pennsylvania. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. I don't know. You guys are all right. I want you guys to know, though, I do have black friends. Don't start it off like that, bro. Don't start it off. Like no, it's nice having black friends when the rest of your friends are just fucking goofy white guys. It's nice. You get some outside perspective, some advice. You just got to be careful of the advice you take from your black friends when it comes to, like, sex. Sex? Money? Anything, bro, anything to do with fighting or anything like that, if if a black person said this is what I would have did or something like that, they're basically come. I ain't even going to get into that. But, bro, it's cool to help. You need white friends, too. I'm telling you. Life of the party. You got to be careful of the advice you. you take from your black friends when it comes to, like, sex. <laughs> when you look like Uncle Buck, it doesn't <laughs> translate. Like, this is the advice my friend gave me when I went on a date with this chick. He was like, hey, yo, Shane. You don't want to go too deep in the pussy. She's always going to want the dick. So you're, you're worried about depth? Like depth is about, I didn't know they had depth. No, no, no. Depth? <laughs> like depth is about, I didn't even know they had depth. I'm just happy to be there. You're worried about like depth as an issue? He was like, you don't want to give her the whole dick. I'm like, that's all I have. <laughs> I've never been like halfway in and been like, oh, oh. You gotta earn the rest of this. Dick. That's insane. Depth? That's crazy. I'm worried about like the noises I'm making. Oh my like goodness, I just I just sound like bro. like a shitty ghost the whole time. Like, <laughs> 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 almost done. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, oh <clears throat> yeah. 
Yeah, I'm going to one of his shows, man. Oh, I hope he's still doing it. Oh, I hope he's still doing it. Oh, my goodness. Bro, yeah, I gotta go. I gotta go. Almost done. Oh, my goodness. Now, this is Oh, my goodness. That's always my first time, yeah. bro. For my face? You ever worry about uh... your face when you're fucking? Don't do it. Don't. Don't think about how dumb you look. You'll end up looking like a fucking psycho trying to look handsome. Lights <laughs> off. No, no. Oh, I never thought of that, bro. Oh, fuck. See, lights off. Lights off, bro. I'm not looking at you, bro. Don't look the at me. Fucking psycho bro. trying to look handsome. The whole just. <laughs> <laughs> It's not good. No. It's worse for me if I let it go. Like, if I just let my face go during sex. Like, I, I look like Brandon Dassey from Making a Murderer the whole time. <laughs> girl's down there, she's like, did you do it? I'm like, oh, no. Oh, my goodness, yeah. bro. Bro, no, I'm not going to lie, bro. So, bro. Kevin Hart, bro. Kevin Hart, bro. If you don't, bro. If you don't at least come out with a, like, a choke, like, up to this, bro, Kevin Hart, bro, you're, bro, like, bro, Kevin Hart, man, this man is hilarious. This man is hilarious. I reacted to two videos, and so far, I cried on both of them. I'm telling you, this man, bro, he's hilarious. He's hilarious. I hope he's still doing shows, man. I have to go to at least one. Never been to a comedy show. He has to be my first one. He has to be. But, man... If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know down below what you want me to react to next. Don't forget to follow my Instagram at tb.dub. And yo, man, I'm out.